Seeing video from inside a bowling alley on Staten Island today as a man collapses to the floor suffering from a heart attack. Now, fortunately, a group of off-duty police officers just happened to be playing in the lane right next to the victim and they jumped into action. Eyewitness News reporter Josh Eininger spoke with the officers. He's live in Lower Manhattan with their story. Josh. Yeah, David, it's a thing about first responders. They are ready to serve whether they're on or off duty. And in this case, these three cops who were bowling in a bowling league jumped right into action. Now, we have video from Rab's Country Lanes in the Dongan Hill Staten of, section of Staten Island. You're looking at 65 year old Roy Spiro. As soon as he lets go of a bowling ball, his heart just gives out. And you could see him stagger a few steps, try to catch himself and then collapse and he had no pulse at all. He was dying there on the floor and that is when these three Brooklyn cops who were just a few lanes over saw the commotion and ran over to help. One of them ran to get the bowling alley's automatic external defibrillator. Two others began CPR, chest compressions and maintaining his airway and they bought enough time for that AED to shock him back to life and before their eyes they brought him back to life and saved him allowing him to spend uh, many many more days with his family. In the last uh, couple of hours here at police headquarters, those three officers were honored by the chief of patrol uh, who said they were a shining example of what it means to be an NYPD officer and they talked about their experience. We were about three or four lanes down, um, so when we noticed him fall, uh, we all ran over. It's great just to help people. So it's, it's second nature to us where we just, we, our training kicks in and, and that is it. This is what we signed up to do. And I'm glad I'm a New York City police officer. Yeah, and this is a picture uh, given to us by the family of 65 year old Roy Spiro. Uh, he actually underwent surgery today after this apparent heart attack he suffered, but it's very clear that the actions of those officers did help uh, save his life. The family uh, released a statement saying that they are forever uh, grateful to people at the bowling alley and those three police officers forever indebted, they said to everyone. A good save.